Hi guys, it's Emily the Babe Girl coming at you with a, another review. We are, oh, excuse me, going to take a look tonight at Mr. Good Vape. This particular one is Moon Sugar. And I have this in my Omega, set at about 0.8 on my Chiyu. The website www.mrgoodbait.com and I'll also link their other website but their Facebook down below. Um, they carry lots of different flavors and not only can you get it there, there's um, other sites you can get this at too. I know, I believe Vape Rev carries it plus a couple others. Their juices come in 20 PG and 80 VG. Now, I got this probably when I first started vaping. And I didn't understand the difference between PG and VG. And I purely looked the flavor and it looked good, so I got it. Um, had I known, I probably wouldn't have got it because I am more on 50-50. I still need that throat hit. Um, so I tend to stay away from the higher VG juices. But it's still a good vape. On the website, it says Moon Sugar stands out in any lineup but beats the inter interrogation every time. The name was given because of the slow gravity of the moon with its huge billowy clouds of vapor production and its high concentration of sugar cookie. This blend is warm and bready with tones of butterscotch and graham cracker crust. Love. Moon sugar is like your private stock you bust out on those special occasions. Uh, on Mr. Good Babe's site, it's 15 mil for 12 bucks, 30 mil for 20, 60 mil for 35 or 100 and 20 mil for 65. And I, because I've had it for a while, I've tried it. When I had the cave fund, I tried it in the cave fund, but I traded out my cave funds because I didn't like them. Um, I've had them in drippers. I've had it in my Kraken. I think I even had it in a pro tank. So I've had it in various devices. Trying to find that throat hit in it and I just never could find it. Um, there's definitely cookie for sure. You can taste the cookie on the inhale and the exhale. It is a really sweet and nice dessert vape. On the inhale, I get cookie. Then on the exhale, I get that smooth butterscotch finish with just a touch of graham cracker. And actually, it is done very, very well. We really like the flavor profile on this vape. Um, if it had a higher PG, it would be in my regular rotation without a doubt. But because it's a higher VG juice, I just I can't do it all the time. Um, but as you can see, I have vaped three quarters of the bottle, so I will finish that one off. But my husband cannot stand the smell of it, so I kind of try not to vape it around him too much. That's what we do as vapors. We try to respect others, including the people that live in our household. I'd say flavor is five. Throat hit probably about a three. And clouds, um, between three and four, is not as good vapor production as you would think, especially with it being such a high VG. Uh, but it is uh, still good. I don't know if I said this before, but my Omega is built at a 0.8. I have, um, I got to rebuild this one. Okay, my YouTubers that I follow and I watch on a regular basis. Um, Rebel Crybaby, Annie Vapes, Richard over at Catskill Vapor, who is a really good guy, uh, JT the Juice Man and Cooter, who are just too funny, and um, they're going through a hard time right now. They lost their job at the vape shop they worked at, which I won't name again, um, but they are really, really great men who I can see doing just great things. 
Beach Travelers, uh, Monica Ray, Stacy and Michael with Fun Bake Friday. They put out videos every Friday, and they're just a really funny couple. you got to watch it. Michael, he's a hoot. NC Vaping, Samantha Montgomery. And you can reach me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, below. Um, any suggestions, product reviews, juice reviews, please contact me by email or Google Plus, Emily Christopher. And like, subscribe, and share. Vape on and vape strong.